Hey, what's going on everyone? This is iReviews. In this video, I will show you the part 3 of the top 10 CD tweaks compatible with iOS 10 up to 10.2. So, I will be uploading a lot of more of these videos, so probably we will go until part 35 or 40, so you make sure you subscribe and not miss any of those videos, and let's get right into the tweaks. Power color. This tweak allows you to customize the battery indicator on the status bar. So you can see here, mine has a purple color, so you can change the color of the battery indicator based on the percentage of the battery that you have left. So you go to the settings of this tweak, you enable it here, and then you enable here custom percent colors, and you go to custom colors here, and you can pick a color, so you will have 20 colors here, and you have, based on this, 20 colors, 100%, you will have a color for 5%, so the first color will be for 100 down to 95, then 95 to 90, so you can change the colors like this. Imperial, this is a very useful tweak that allows you to have your favorite app right here on the app switcher of your device. So anytime you open the app switcher, you can have here your favorite app or the app that you use the most and you can open it directly from there. It should also add it to the lock screen of your device, but right now it's not working, probably needs to be updated for iOS 10, so it works just on the app switcher at the moment. So under the settings, you have an enable button right here, and then you can enable here, show in lock screen, and also show in multitasking, which means that it will show it on the app switcher. Then you can go ahead and select the application that you want to see. All you have to do is just select any of your apps right here. Triple space allows you to easily and quickly enter any text that you want simply by triple pressing the space bar on the keyboard. So you go to the settings of this tweak and enable it here, and here you will have to enter the text that you want. Then click done here, and when you are on your keyboard, all you have to do is just triple press the space bar and it will show you that text. Lock safety. This is a tweak for the lock screen of your device. So on iOS, you can go ahead and shut down a device from the lock screen. So this tweak will prevent that from happening. So you press the power down, button and it won't show the power down menu so nobody can turn off your device when it's locked. Blurry bar. This tweak allows you to set a blurred background on the status bar of your device. So you can see mine here has a blurred background and you can change that so you can change this style by going to the settings of this tweak. So you enable the tweak right here, then here you have style, you have different styles you can choose from and just pick the style and go back to your home screen and it will change it, you don't need to respring your device. FT Adjust. This tweak will allow you to change the size of the title of your folder. So you can see here how big the font is and you can change the size using a slider. So you will have the slider here under settings, you don't have anything else to configure. You can just change the size using this slider. So you can see now how small the title is. So if you want to make it smaller, you slide it on the left side. If you want to make this, this size of the title bigger, you just slide the slider on the right side. Transparent Volume 8. This tweak allows you to change the transparency of the volume hood as you can see it right here. To do that you need to go to the settings of this tweak and you can use this slider right here to change the transparency of the volume hood. And then you need to respring your device for the changes to take effect. No White Flash. This is a simple tweak. All it does is that it will disable the white flash. When you take a screenshot of your device, you won't have the white flash, it will just play the sound and it will of course save the screenshot, but no white flash. Reach Offset. This tweak allows you to choose how much you want your screen to come down when you use the reachability view. So you can change that space here, you can see this space here, how much the screen comes down. You can just go to the settings of this tweak, just slide here, enable custom offset here and then just slide this slider right here so you can see on the left it will be smaller and on the right here it will be much bigger so if you need the screen to come down way more you just slide on the right and you can see how much it will come down you can also set here a custom interval of the tabs that you that you use to invoke the reachability view and also you can choose custom tabs here so you will have to choose how many tabs you will have to do to invoke the reachability view Color Fill. This tweak will fill up this space here on the reachability view based on the color of the app that you are using. So you can see here on the settings, all white. If I go to the reachability view, it will be white. But if I go to another app here on iTunes, you can see it's almost all black. So if I go here, the reachability view will also be black. This is pretty cool. The tweak doesn't have any options to configure. 
So that is it for this video guys, I hope you guys enjoyed it. As I said at the beginning of the video, I will be uploading a lot of more of these videos, so make sure you subscribe, do not miss any of them and enjoy these cool iOS 10 tweaks. So that's it, don't forget to subscribe, also go ahead and follow me on my social media, you will find all the links in the description of the video.